Hey everybody, James Harrison, Phelps Game Calls. I want to show you guys the new Harrison Hooter. I'm going to show you how I run the call and how to get the most out of this call. So basically you hold the bottom of it and you say like you're saying okay, just like that. First thing I tell guys is just get air through the call to make a sound. And I'm just with that. As I do that, I'll bring my bottom hand up to make an air chamber to get that deeper sound of an owl. So I'm just like that. A barred owl says, who cooks for you? Who cooks for you all? So then I'll huff that into the call. Now the roll I'm doing on the end is a roll and I just hold with my throat or you can do it with your tongue where you go so you Another call you can do is laugh of the barred owl. And basically I add the air pressure and then I open my hand and I say with the word wah. So basically I'm hooting like this. Then I'm gonna build air pressure and open my hand and say wah. So I'm What that does is get an excited pitch out there, carries a long ways and we'll get a turkey to gobble. So you put it all together A lot of guys ask me how I run my owl hooter in the mornings to locate birds. One thing if you're hunting by yourself is I like to do a couple short hoots at first just so if that turkey does gobble, I'm not blowing the call and I, I don't hear him gobble. If I'm hunting with a person, I have them step away from me a little ways, then I'll hit the call and I'll let them listen. But here's an example of what I do in the mornings to start them up. I'll listen, see if he gobbles. If it doesn't hit him, I'll hit him again. One just gobbled right there. So if you guys heard that, I did a owl hoot, hit the eight note, he gobbled back. So what I'll do is short, I'll let that, if I don't hear nothing gobble on that one, I'll let that set for maybe a minute, two minutes, I'll do it again. If I don't hear nothing then, I might get a little more excited and hit him with a laugh. All the time, keeping my ears open, listening for that turkey.